Hello! Today I'd like to show you how to circuit bend uh, Yamaha Portasound PSS80 with several interesting modifications. Uh, first I will show you the modifications, then uh, you can choose which one is uh, right for you. Then I will show you very detailed uh, how to modify this key. First, uh, what's annoying is this here. Can you, you can hear this. It clicks every time you push a button. You hear this, it's annoying. If you play a song and you want to change this, it clicks and this is annoying. And I've uh, found a kill select click switch. You hear nothing. The first. Now the groove clicks. Here you have the fuzz filter, this is very interesting too. Of course, you have a fast mutilation. Now the groove clicks. If you turn up the fuzz modulation too far, it will crash a little bit, uh, or will crash completely. You see, wired combinations are possible with this here. <coughs> now we'll show it this here. The glitch uh, glitches. These two here make light glitches. If you push the this, uh, or it will make hard glitches. Uh, if how they like. Uh, this here make uh, instant crashes and glitches. And this switch you can choose points to connect this button to.
Interesting things are possible with this. Uh, now I will show you uh, the modifications, how you can do this, all this stuff, and it hopefully works like this uh, when you are at your home. <coughs> uh, what you need are two potties, four switches, four temporary push buttons, one RCA jack, one diet, any kind of diet you like, one 44k ohm resistor. Uh, with this you can choose the volume of the groove clicks. Yes, and uh, lots of cables. Okay, so let's start with the uh, easy things, uh, with the reset button. You have to connect it uh, here and there. <coughs> it's very simple. Let's go to the hill select click switch. You can connect it here and there. Let's come to the groove clicks. You can connect them here and there. And you can add the resistor. You can choose another resistor if you like them louder or quieter. You can try it out. <coughs> now let's come to the fuzz filter. The fuzz filter is uh, a normal potentiometer. You have to connect it here, here and here. But you must cut this resistor. The fuzz filter is a 10k potentiometer. Now let's come to the fuzz modulation. You must connect it uh, here and there. It's a uh, 1k potentiometer. Now we come to the video out. The video out is connected to, to the here and there. And you uh, can add a small capacitor if you like. If you don't want it, you can leave it out. Now we come to the glitches. It's a uh, normal push buttons and one diet. I think you can use any diet if you, you can find most of the diets have the right ring on it and you have to connect it like this and uh, it will make the glitches you have heard before. Here you can add a bridge and I think there are coming more clearer tones of it. You can cut the resistor on the other side or leave it. I have cut it it's away because I don't need it anymore. Yeah, if you like uh, this video and this demonstration, you can uh, subscribe, please, and uh, come back soon. Bye.